Of you know what? I found up. a reference like this on the temper of Euphonidae. So that's what I was looking at. Yeah. Hey, I can make a little change over here. Because this has ripped too. Patrona is jelling over your skills. Patrona is ten times better than I am. <laughs> That's why she has ten times more watchers and subscribers. And, and love. Views and page views on DeviantArt. <laughs> she says what? No, I don't. <laughs> Since when? Uh, you know what? I'm I'm gonna settle the question right now. I'm going to your pages. You know what? That's real. That's not really a good show of your um talent because I just had something commissioned by um V V yeah a really popular sculpturist on DeviantArt and she like, always gets front page because she does pony sculptures. So, like, the day that my sculpture was finished, it was, like, freaking 271 page views. I'm like, never had that many page views in my life! Like, my page views, <laughs> my page views average out to, like, 20 a day, I think. So, you know, if you're social, you got more page views, which makes me mad because I'm not social. <laughs> I'm not social either, and what makes me even more annoyed is when talented artists feel the need to serial favorite, where they will actually sit on the front page and just favorite everything new coming in. Ugh, that. And these are people who are actually talented! I'm like, why are you even wasting your time with this? Go join a group! Start spreading your art! You'll have more watchers in no time! Seriously. But, eh, they expect- they- no, because they favorite your stuff, and they expect you to go to their page after and thank them. So, oh no, wait, you're already in their gallery, you're gonna look at their stuff. And I'm just like, ugh. This might sound rude of me, but I don't thank people for favorites. Mostly <laughs> because you get favorites every Stopped. day, it's hard to keep track of. I thank people for watches. <laughs> Finish May! We have another one in here! <gasps> Hi! Hi, darling, nice to see you. Oh my gosh, it's a party. Oh my gosh, I'm super excited. <laughs> you have an audience. I, I told you I'd be shameless. Tinker, it's all because of you. Never. Always. It's all your talent. Nice. It's, you're, you're just oozing it. It's, it's all over nice. the place. And by the way, I settled the question. You do have more watchers and page views than Katrona. <laughs> Lies. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, you looked up the proof and I am calling lies. <laughs> yeah. Because I no. make all the sense in the world. <laughs> <laughs> no, but how is this possible? You're both ridiculously talented. You both need more watchers. <sighs> the talented people. No, that's people. that's that's nonsense. I don't even accept this. The talented people. We don't. We don't. I don't even. I don't even accept this. I don't accept this. Just told you. Okay, and by the way, that looks Rift, a little better. Riff just made a good point by saying that ponies always front page. Well, yeah. Except <laughs> mine. My ponies don't front page. <laughs> I don't care, though. Actually, I do have this, like, pony secret weapon that I will be uploading soon. I don't want to tell anybody because I'm live streaming. But uh, it's, okay. it's, 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 it combines ponies with a very current topic, and I think that it'll get me, like, a million views. <laughs> I think I know what you're talking about. Tigger knows, because I told her, and I showed her. <laughs> so, I'm excited to do that one, actually, because it's cute. Is it the animation idea? No, it's, um, I did the three daily sketches in a row, and it was, like, a comic. Hmm. Yes, I remember that. Yeah. Yep. That's fantastic. I want to get that up. Patrona, llamas are amazing. Llamas are amazing. You give me a llama, I'll give you a llama. Seriously. Llama love. Who, 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 who doesn't love llamas? Who doesn't love Cusco? Seriously, oh my gosh. If you're a part <laughs> of the Disney group, you should be, if you're not. They do llama Saturdays, I believe, and each a person from the Disney group is picked at random, and everyone from the Disney group just floods them with llama badges. It's so cool. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. It's so super cool. I've yeah. never been picked, but I still think it's hilarious. I like but that braid. Pull like the that. lever, crunk. 
Wrong! <laughs> 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 yes. I love it. It's fantastic. We got a good group of people right now. <laughs> oh <laughs> yeah, my party peeps. I think minute I think minute poor Minish May just had a nostalgia rush. From I Emperor's New Groove or Toe Patrol? Hmm? For Emperor's New Groove or Toe Patrol? Both. <laughs> <laughs> we are all about nostalgia. Up in Disma, yes. Just bring it flooding back. Uh, it is flooding back. We uh actually had some interesting conversations with Patrona before the other people showed up. And we will have more because it's a party. It's a it is. nostalgia party. I have no idea when I'm going to stop this live stream, so if anyone's curious, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's just pretty much when you get bored, duck out. Duck yeah, out. yeah, pretty much. Yeah. Although, frankly, I, I don't find this boring at all. I think this is, this is amazing. Yeah, I love a wife. Yeah, I love boo. No, this is just, this is too amazing for words. I knew that I had to have somebody in here to talk with me <laughs> while we were doing this because it would have been too boring otherwise. I, I don't know, I just, I don't, I don't really enjoy sitting through live streams where it's just music. And I, I like people to also have a presence in their live stream where they actually, you know, they talk and they talk to the people in the live streams. Yeah, having that constant communication with your fan base not fan base in this case but your watchers that's just that makes it so much better it's it's true i i happen to agree with the sentiment everyone <laughs> loves being acknowledged oh my gosh everybody is getting together and pulling the emperor's <laughs> new crew theme song <laughs> this is amazing I'm sorry, you just put off the Emperor's Groove. Sorry! sorry. <laughs> you were saying... What's his name? Cusco! <laughs> He's the king of the world! Cusco! <laughs> Is he a hippo what? <laughs> I love it. <laughs> oh, it's amazing. I'm totally off tune, though. It's terrible. Live. <laughs> Minish applauds our duet, just FYI. <laughs> thank you, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, thank you. Now you need to draw a picture of Beauty Stem bowing. <laughs> oh my gosh, Tigger Jet, you set up my next live stream. <laughs> <laughs> That's fantastic. Tigger Jet's my agent. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I secretly tie her to a chair and force her to do art. That's how this live stream is happening. <laughs> It was Tigger's idea, none of it was mine. Help me! Ah, oh. <laughs> oh, it's fantastic. Uh, hey, we're all jokes in here. That's right. <laughs> if this isn't constantly keeping you entertained, then I'm failing. So If it's not keeping you entertained, then go home, right? <laughs> <laughs> Closing time. You don't have to go home, but you can't stay here. Well, Patrona says that she is very entertained. Uh. So, hey, I'm entertained. I'm happy. Can break it out into song. And the leaning tower of Chisa. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Maze Er. <laughs> I don't do a good Polly Shore, but I don't care. Let's see. Ah, uh, everybody. <laughs> I just brought that goof troop for people. And Minish May just remembered House of Mouse. Fudge, yeah. Goofy movie. Goofy movie was from Goof Troop, though. Yes. I mean, you know, that, that wasn't technically off. Goofy movie's freaking amazing. Yes. Gotta stand out above the crowd. Even if you gotta shout out loud. Tomorrow's, Tomorrow's the only, only face, face you, you see. see. Gonna stand out. T notice me. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that's fantastic. Oh, I gotta watch it again. <laughs> Did I tell you, Tink? I totally made Panda buy it for me. Oh, that's fantastic. We were I at Sam's. I actually bought the DVD a while was... ago. What? I actually bought the, uh, the DVD a while ago for Goofy Movie. You know, Panda doesn't like that movie, which was like travesty. So we were at <laughs> Sam's, and it was less than 10 bucks, and I'm like, uh, I want it. Please get it for me. <laughs> I, I found it in the bargain bin for five bucks, and I was like, how is this show? How is this five bucks? 
I'm buying it. Seriously, it's mine! <laughs> no one go near it. <laughs> How many me? I get five a Bye. <laughs> mine. <laughs> oh my gosh. Someone started singing the Chippendale Rescue Rangers theme <gasps> and I feel terrible I never watched that show. Ch -ch -ch Chippendale! I didn't watch it as much as I should have because Disney cartoons on Saturday mornings were hard to wake up for. For me, at least. <laughs> <laughs> Rip says that he heard they're going to be making a Chippendale movie. Oh, oh and someone God. just said Tailspin. <laughs> mm. Never watched Tailspin. Uh, oh, Tailspin, that's another show. I didn't watch as much as I should have. But, uh, a movie. Just sitting in here having this nostalgia rush makes me feel fantastic. Oh my, yes. I, you yeah, know, I always tried to catch Hamtaro, but I never had the opportunity to, and I was always so sad. I was always so very sad. But I still, I think I remember the theme song. Hamtaro! <laughs> was it in Japanese or English? No, it was, it was in English. Okay. They had it on, uh, well, I don't know who hears in Canada and who hears in the States. But uh, in Canada, it was on YTV. I never watched Sam <laughs> that, That's perfectly okay. It was, it was, a, it was a show, but a hamster. They were cute. They, just never watched it. <laughs> just saying, it was a show, but a hamster. Can't hate it. No. No hate, no hate for the ham taro. No hate. No hate for the ham. <laughs> gotta, gotta love the ham. There. Subway train interlogs. Oh, yes. I mean, back when they had good creative commercials that were, you know, animated and crazy instead of just weird logos. I don't know. I'm uh, although, to be fair, I haven't really, really watched YTV in a while. They also had that... Personally, I didn't like Dragon Ball Z, but they had that hilarious commercial where the cast of the Dragon Ball Z were doing an opera. You know, what's if Dragon Ball Z were an opera? <laughs> oh my. And they just put an opera song to everybody Goodness. screaming. <laughs> Why haven't I not seen this? <laughs> I'm going to show you. You know what? After the live stream, I'm so sending you a link. After the live yeah. stream, yes. Because holy cow. That sounds freaking amazing. <laughs> <laughs> I love Dragon Ball Z and I want it. <laughs> I didn't even like Dragon Ball Z, and that commercial was amazing. <laughs> oh my gosh. I wonder if it's, the, like, the new voices or the old voices. Um, they actually didn't have any of the voices in the... It was just, basically, the animation of the characters screaming to opera music. But it was fantastic. Oh my gosh, I want... <laughs> I want it! Oh, back in the day, because they actually made creative commercials. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, people are, they still have their VHS tapes. Oh man, back in the day of VHS. I know someday I'm going to have a kid and they're going to be like, Mommy, what's VHS? And you're going to be like, tear. <laughs> <laughs> it was my childhood. <laughs> Sweetie, it was Mommy's childhood. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, Minish, I take it you are in the States? Just guessing. Because she mentioned Nickelodeon logo. I didn't have Nickelodeon. I'm so sad. Nick, 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 nick. Nickelodeon. <laughs> yeah. Isn't this amazing? We actually do have someone in Canada and someone in the States in this live stream. <laughs> <laughs> so everyone gets it. Oh my gosh. Tinker, you didn't have Nickelodeon? We did not have Nickelodeon. So I wonder if like anyone in this chat remembers this little jingle. Okay, ready? Okay. Write to me, Stick Stickly, P.O. Box 963, New York City, New York State, 10108. <laughs> <laughs> Riff apparently remembers that show and he's in the UK. So. Oh my gosh, <laughs> that song is engraved in my mind forever. <laughs> Sorry, Riff, not trying to ignore you. We know you're in the UK. I'm just saying because I saw Nickelodeon. And as soon as I see Nickelodeon, I assume states because we did not have Nickelodeon. So I'm saying in the live stream... Right now, the local people are in the United States, in Canada. And Minish apparently doesn't remember that. Uh, uh, people are remembering Rupert. Rupert the Bear. Rupert the Bear. Do I remember that? 
He was a white bear with a with a red sweater and a yellow scarf. Was that was, was that in the states? I don't even. I don't I remember, know. I remember Rupert. I don't know. I'd look it I up. Really, but I'm I never really streaming. watched Rupert, but I remember it. Was it a, uh, a kids show? Patrona remembers Babar. Um, yes. Oh, I remember Rupert Babar. Rupert was a kids show, and yes, Babar. I actually had a VHS of the very first Babar story, the the story where he, he went from being a regular elephant to becoming king. It was actually... Hmm. I don't know. <laughs> it was, you know, it was one of those... Hmm. This is a product of its time. <laughs> <laughs> uh, people are remembering the Moomins. The what? The Moomins. is a Finnish show, so I don't know if everyone... I, I never actually watched the Moomins, but... Thanks to Taylor, I know it. That doesn't sound familiar to me. Is that Canada? Um, you know, I don't actually remember it ever being on air here. Someone can correct me if they're in Canada and they watched it, but I never saw it. Never saw it on YTV, never saw it on Teletoon. Certainly never saw it on Teletoon. Oh man, I remember those old commercials Teletoon had. Ooh. Oh, Tele-Quebec. Okay, that makes sense. Tele-Quebec also has Pokemon, and we never had Pokemon on Teletoon. No, Pokemon snap. Was <laughs> I was incredibly petty. I'm like, ah, oh, Quebec gets Pokemon on Teletoon, we don't. And, of course, my lazy butt was talking, and I have to go all the way over to YTV. <laughs> it was so difficult. Yeah, no, it's fine. It, yeah. <laughs> I swear I was so lazy, I wondered how I could breathe some days. Too lazy to breathe. Too lazy to live. Oh my gosh, someone remembers sticking around. I remember that show. I think I remember that show when it was just a short, too. Sticking around, Who, who, remembers, eh? who remembers Doodles? This, this is a Canadian one, but who remembers Doodles? The Doodles short. <laughs> Minish remembers Doodles. Anybody? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, everyone remembers Doodles. It's fantastic. I I used to love Doodles. Always made the also Bob and Scott, which um, I I never really watched Bob and Scott, but I know I always had it between things when I was trying to record Toe Patrol <laughs> back in the day. Those were the days. People remembering on Talkative Rabbit. Oh man, you know I actually didn't really like on Talkative Rabbit. I mean, it's nice that they actually had um, main protagonists who were silent, but I don't know. It just felt like nothing really happened. Wait, what is the name of the show? The Untalkative... Actually, Untalkative Bunny. The Untalkative Bunny. That sounds hysterical. <laughs> it was um, It was essentially about a yellow bunny who was mute, and he hung out with a squirrel friend, and, and now people are remembering Sheep in the Big City. <laughs> Wait, that oh sounds God. familiar to me, Sheep in the Big City. Yep. Everyone remembering time slots. Yeah, we we actually uh, Foxy had mentioned Rocco's Modern Life already. Yay, Nickelodeon! Oh my gosh, it's a show I remember. Redwall. Yep. Patrona. Actually, I re I mentioned Redwall. Patrona had a nostalgia rush. I think when I mentioned Redwall <laughs> and Silverwing. Uh, someone's remembering Cat Dog. Oh my gosh, Cat Dog. Courage. Car oh man, so, uh, Tig, Tig and I just had a, a conversation about courage, bef like recently, didn't we? We did. Freaking Water courage! Down. You know, after all these years, I finally got to watch Watership Down. It was so sad. Wait, Watership Down wasn't a cartoon; it was just a movie, right? It was a movie, yeah. Okay, but I, someone's remembering it. So it was it's okay. Fine. Yeah, I'm saying I finally got around to watching that. It was so sad. Yeah, uh, Panda loves. Panda's my fiance, and if anyone's curious. Panda loves Watership Down. He had the book read to him as a child, and he was so excited to share it with me. And, you know, it's it a good book. It was a good read. But um, we watched the movie together, and I'm like, huh. <laughs> 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 we got characters dying here that shouldn't die. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. I mean, I never read the book, but, I mean, I, I watched the movie, and I was like, ah. 
why did I get the feeling that these characters are not supposed to be dying? <laughs> yeah, Tink, if you read the book, it's it's, it's infinitely better. <laughs> uh, yeah, I wish I had more time to read. Wish my wrists would cooperate. I can't even pick stuff up. It's pathetic. Yeah, well, but why it? Mm, I'll be okay. I'm just I'm just being a buzzkill. I don't want to be a buzzkill, though. We're supposed to be happy. We're remembering happy things. We are being happy and remembering happy things. Who remembers Doug? Oh, man, Doug. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Riff, I have flexor tendonitis in the wrists. Doug, funny. And I can't... Like, it's actually quite ridiculous because cannot hold a pencil, cannot pick up heavy things, cannot even... Like, just everything. Yeah, it sucks. Ugh, it's not your Been fault. dealing with this for a long time. Seriously, Tinker Jet wants, just wants to be now. Done. healed already. For a month of flexor tendonitis is not fair! It's like, I should be happy. I get to actually wa sit around and watch stuff and, you know, not have to work as hard because I have flexor tendonitis, but at the same time, it's like, but I'm not doing anything! Hmm. What about all the art that I want to do and all the stories I want to write? gonna come back to that hand later. It's being a bitch. Codename Kids Next Door! And Pepper Ann! Fudge yes! Oh, man. So Tink and I were talking about Codename Kids Next Door before oh, I freaking loved that show. I was Absolutely actually adored it. I, I went to the American... Uh, my boyfriend was sharing the... Uh, his, his Netflix with me. And he... Uh, essentially, I, I went on the American Netflix... And I was so sad to find that they only had ep uh, seasons four through six. And I was like, where are seasons one to three? Right. Oh, I couldn't get next door right from the get-go. Of course, I started watching the episode and I started cracking the heck up. Because Seriously. of inappropriate stuff I shouldn't mention here. But anyway. So funny. <laughs> Some of those episodes can get so funny sometimes. Yes. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I don't know why. Like It was so simple, but I just loved everything about it. Hey, simple can be amazing. Kids against care. teenagers. The uh, teenagers and adults against the kids. It's freaking mm -hmm. hysterical. Swerving. Uh, I I am having nostalgia gas. Nostalgia over here. meltdown over here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm gonna explode. Uh. What else? See, Codename Kids Next Door was kind of near the end of my cartoon watching days, though. You know, hey, if anyone in this call can... not call. <laughs> live stream can suggest to me something good to watch, cartoon-wise, I would be really appreciative. Because all of the cartoons that I've been seeing now, I think the only one that I really enjoyed was The Amazing World of Gumball. Oh my gosh. That <laughs> show is so funny. <laughs> I actually have not seen that show yet, but oh, I know that a bunch of people are still falling over themselves over Adventure Time, and I don't understand why. I tried. I tried. I just couldn't do it. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Pretty right, much same try. here. <laughs> Pretty much same here. I, I'm not a fan of Adventure Time. I don't want to offend anyone, but I tried. I really did. You know what? Like you said earlier, everyone's entitled to an opinion. Like, I just... I don't like that style of humor, which is probably why I didn't enjoy Ren and Stimpy, which is why I didn't enjoy shows like The Ripping Friends, which is why, you know, just all the shows with that style of humor just doesn't mesh with me. Just nah. <laughs> People are recommending Gravity Falls. Is that actually a I've show? I've heard of that. Yeah, it's that, um, remember Tank, you were asking me, like, who's this character from? And I said, oh, it's from Gravity Falls. Um, oh! Apparently, like, a horror show, but not horror. really. Horror. Yeah, like if it's, it's it, I don't think it's scary. It just deals with like the horror genre. Oh. Maybe like making light out of it. I don't know. Maybe somebody can clarify that <laughs> for me. Can someone like shed some light on this. <laughs> <laughs> but it's on Disney. I know that. Oh, consider it the modern Scooby Doo. Apparently, it's funny. Okay. Well, I I love Scooby Doo. Seriously, all the love for Scooby Doo. So I'll I'll try Gravity Falls. <laughs> Also, I I am chock full of underground cartoons. <laughs> I wonder if anyone's also seen Wander Over Yonder. Uh, not me. But... I think that's what it's called. Um, it was the new. Is it Craig McCracken cartoon on Disney? Uh, no, no. Or was it? I I Jen think Patrona. I think Patrona. 
um, has seen Wander over Yonder, Spotty as well. I, I can't remember. It's the same guy who directed Hotel Transylvania. I never saw that either. I think. Uh, I, think I didn't have a childhood. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. Take a shot. No, Hotel Transylvania was like, eh, it was, it's a cute kids movie, but that's it. Um, shoot. I'm going to have to look this up now. Sorry, everyone. I'm going to just stop my drawing here. Wander over yonder. Da, 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 da. Come on. Amazing. We all get to have a nostalgia trip. This is, yeah. <laughs> Fantastic. Craig McCracken, okay. Yeah, Patrono's actually... Uh, oh, same. and... Oh, sorry. See, I can't read, so we can't keep up. Sorry, guys. Apparently, Lauren Faust also um, worked on this, too. Haven't we already seen that Lauren Faust is involved in everything amazing? <laughs> That's because she's freaking married to Craig McCracken, who is amazing alongside... Uh, right? Jendi, <laughs> or however you say his name. You just got a you just got a power duo going on right now. Seriously. Between those two. I want I want that kind of marriage where it's just totally like power power duo and you could do anything. That's what I want. Foxy, we are the power duo. It's a farce. I know. <laughs> I know. We are the power duo. We are. Everybody is all over Gravity Falls. Uh oh. Uh. Spotty is making us promise her that we'll watch Gravity Falls. I will promise if I can find it, I swear. <laughs> okay, so if we, if we can find it, we can keep this promise. Oh, Patrona's making us pinky swear. <laughs> Hang on. I'm trying to reach. Why is it not going anywhere? <laughs> that, that's my pinky. <laughs> I swear. <laughs> that's that's great. <laughs> <laughs> I swear. If I can find the show, I will watch it. <laughs> Patrona reached her pinky to it. That's that's fantastic. <laughs> Live streaming is fun. Let's do this again sometime. Seriously, all over this. Cross your heart, hope to fly, stick a cupcake in your eye. Now, where's that cupcake? <laughs> oh, what I wouldn't give for a cupcake now. I've been sitting here and my stomach's growling, like, feed me. If I was there, I'd cook for you, and you know I would. <gasps> Chicken noodle soup. Chicken noodle soup. Mm. And then with an amazing dessert, because cheesecake. Oh my yes. Oh, man. Tink, I'm dying for that again. <laughs> you know what stinks is like right around the time when you come up for the wedding, I can't have anything fattening because I need to fit it into my dress. So <laughs> <laughs> you're going to make this awesome cheesecake. Panda's going to be enjoying it. And I'm going to be like, I want are you, it. <laughs> are you kidding? I'm totally going to hang out for after your wedding so I can feed you cheesecake. <laughs> Because after the wedding, you can eat whatever the fudge you want. Finger dead pinky swear. Uh, if, I was on, if I was on the live stream, I would. Just FYI, Foxy, you're adorable. Tinker Jet, you're there. amazing. <laughs> Sticking my pinky to my screen, why is it not going nowhere? <laughs> <laughs> Tinker Jet, thank you for helping me communicate with everyone in this live stream. Hey, I am super happy that we can all be here, that we can all be happy people, that we I, can all reflect and share good times together. That's right. And Patrona says we are all amazing, and I can't agree more. We are all super nostalgic faces. Super nostalgic and super happy, and just let it all go, you know? Just be. Let the good times roll. Let the good times roll. Oh my yes. I'm very musical, so please don't mind me if I just break a song stop. randomly. <laughs> <laughs> You're not allowed to change. We You're not allowed to leave. <laughs> I also like references. Yes. Let's see here. She is the reference queen to my king. Oh my yes. Oh my yes. I think that'll work. Patrona apparently breaks in a song often herself, so... There, high there, five no. for Patrona. Yes. Big ol' high Again. Five. Because we've been having high fives a lot. Yes. 
I like singing too. I'm just terrible at it. <laughs> I'm working on that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 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 uh. Uh. 